it's mail opening time. We have a bunch of packages to open today, and I'd like to first off thank Charles for editing yet another amazing fan mail video, so thank you Charles. And also a quick reminder, please do not send us live things in the mail. I think, oh man, she's just gonna climb right up. Really? I think she's ready to start. <laughs> Tegan sends a plush of Cheyenne, who she is scared of. Look, it's you. Tegan also sent us like a care package for Cheyenne, because there's a Ooh. whole bag of banana chips in here. It looks like there is some sugar added, so I'll only be able to give her a little bit. I'm sure she'll probably have some later, but I'll just give her a little bit. Also, I love your artwork, Tegan. This is beautiful. Thank you for all the gifts. I have Shannon, Bailey, and Porter sent you oh, a wand, whoa. So here's your serpent taming wand, carefully crafted, crafted with a core of heartstring of dragon. Aw, thank you so much, I love the wand. Should we see if it works? Cheyennes disappears. Where did she go? She just pooped on me, she's oh, over here. She pooped on you. You are a pain, oh I like my this gosh. Wand. I like this wand. Thanks. Thank you, Shannon, Bailey, and Porter for the wand. It makes Cheyenne poop on its back. I love it. Uh, Laura sent a whole package of goodies for Rex. Rex, I guess, is a big fan of Frozen. I'm just now learning. This is awesome. Oh, there's a bunch of pennies inside. Oh, Dove chocolate with caramel. M&Ms and caramel. Oh my gosh, and there's also this thing in there. Are mm. those Bakugan things? It might be. Do we have to put it on a magnet? Oh, it opens! Thanks for all the goodies, Laura. I can't wait to dive into these, which I might just do right now, actually. Agnes from Sweden sent us some stuff to do in quarantine, like coloring in pages. And then they also sent this hatchable egg. Whoa! Do we get to hatch it? And you just submerge it in water, except the only cup I could find that was big enough is my huge water glass. Oh, no. How, how long does it take to hatch? 24 hours. So oh my gosh. Back to this. Really? There it goes. Let the incubation begin. Yep. Four to six days later. Oh my gosh, it hatched. It's actually kind of cool to watch it hatch over the length of a few days. It's a baby triceratops. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this is an adorable note from Vasilisa and B. They love Cheyenne. They love you. They also have a question for you, Ed. What is your favorite lizard? Species of lizard. Cayman lizards are pretty cool. Yeah, they are. Yeah, I'd probably go with Cayman lizard. Nice. Aw, a very cute note from Depp as well, who really likes ball pythons, or pied ball pythons. So a question for you, Ed. If you could mix any second morph to add on to pied, what would you do for a ball python? Just albino is cool. Albino pied? pied? But nice. banana pieds are cool too. Ah, oh, cool. That's what I was going to pick. Jennifer sent us over some reptile supplies. A little water dish, I'm guessing. That's adorable. Oh, that's... And all of these things were used for her late Central American banded gecko. Oh, cool. So he unfortunately passed away and she Aww. no longer needed them. So she sent them to us. That's so sweet of you. She oh also gosh. wrapped the so crap out of them. So Ed has spent the last 10 minutes unwrapping them all. Well, I mean, they all made it. They all made it perfect, So though. the wrapping job was great. It Jennifer, thank you so much. We will totally be using these for our reptiles. Ava asks us, which do we think is a better pet, a snake or a gecko? Hmm. I guess that's personal preference, but... I'm always going to say snake. Snakes only eat and poop once a week, so. Yeah. Snakes are easier, but I don't know if that necessarily makes them better. That's right. Isn't that right, Cheyenne? She also sent something in fleece. <gasps> oh, oh. Oreo dairy milk. Whoa. Oh. That, is that like cookies and cream? We haven't had that one yet, so I guess. Uh, Should we try it? Sure. Okay. Oh. That is good. Mm -hmm. It's like an infusion of two different chocolate bars. Thank you, Ava. This is delicious. Scarlet sent us over some Pokemon cards, some chocolate, and some flowers. Aww. Look, I have a bouquet of flowers. I Are you going to get married Throw today? At you. Oh, jeez. Emily's was... getting married Get next. She caught the bouquet. I'm getting married next. This has juke bugs on a sticker on the package. Oh, didn't they already send us something like two years ago? We've sent you two pairs of our ultimate buds and three protective cases to go with them. With coupon code SNAKE, your fans will get 20% off all of our products indefinitely. That's well, cool. And our cases can be used. That here. 
Yeah. And the coupon code here. There we go. Perfect. So these are the ultimate buds. Well, these are like the new and improved version of what they Gen sent two. us. That's cool. Ah, thank you so much, Juke Buds. That was really nice of you. Cheyenne decided those aren't supposed to be in your ear. I guess not, but I am so excited to use these. So yeah, if you want 20% off anything at their store. Code SNAKE, 20% off indefinitely. That's awesome too. This is a note from Amy. It says, since you seem to get so many Pokemon cards, I thought you'd like something a little different. They are Pokemon masks. That's awesome. Oh, and they're made locally. They're right in Minnesota. Can you believe it, Cheyenne? I know. Amy, thank you so much. Pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. Nice. Thank you. That was so nice of her. Thank you, Alexis and Krista, for the awesome alligator chip clip. We can't wait to use it. Zoe sent us a bunch of artwork, oh. some Pokemon cards. Whoa, thanks, Zoe. And she wants to know, is Cheyenne going to have any eggs? That's a great question, Zoe. Is Cheyenne, I mean, she is physically able to produce eggs even though they'd be unfertilized and I guess she was a breeder bird before we got her. She probably won't have any eggs unless she gets into like a hormonal cycle which she hasn't done with us and we've had her for about 10 years now so I doubt she will. Good question. She also sent a snake puppet. Oh my gosh that's a puppet? This is what I assume it has a hole in the bottom of its head. Oh it's totally a puppet that's adorable. Thank you I might be able to use that in programs. There you go. Morgan sent some adorable artwork. I love it, oh, actually. Oh, my neck is so long there. <laughs> yeah, it is. Aw, more artwork. She also sent some treats for Cheyenne. Take one. Reach in. Yay! Oh, Cheyenne loves it. Thank you, Morgan. From Lois, your channel uh, really inspired me to dive into a more unconventional career, and I feel so fulfilled because of it. Aw. I started an isopod merch shop and here are some of my patches. Oh my gosh, okay, Pod Patrol, go check out Lois's business page and oh my gosh, these are legit isopod patches. No way, these are great. Thank you so much, Lois. Again, there you go, go check her out. Isabella sent us a bunch of Pokemon cards. Oh, thanks, Isabella. Some leaves and things for decorations in the oh, snake enclosure. We'll totally use those. And she has a couple questions. Okay. Uh, do you have any ball pythons? We have one. Her name is Martha. She's a now 18 year old rescue. Oh, she also sent a dollar too. Sorry. Aw, thank you. You don't uh, have to send us money guys, but that, that'll go to Rex, I promise. Can reptiles catch COVID-19? Ooh, as far as I'm aware, they cannot catch COVID-19. I've heard of dogs and cats catching it, but I don't think it's mammal to reptile. Yeah, I don't think they can think catch they it, can. thankfully. Would you rather have a never-ending chocolate or Pokemon? Oh, like a real-life Pokemon or never-ending chocolate? Uh, real-life Pokemon. That was tough. <laughs> Would you rather create a new species of snake or get a two-headed snake? Oh, there you Ooh, go. Two-headed snake. We did get a two-headed. Uh, probably a new species. That'd be really cool. She also sent Cheyenne nuts. Oh, She's going to love these. I have a box from Jasmine in England. An orange flavored Kit Kat? Oh. Have you ever heard of that before? Oh, weird. Oh, it's an orange flavored Kit Kat. Okay, there's a shirt in here too. Oh, no way. Whoa. Jasmine, that's so cool. Those are our animals. It fits. Jasmine also sends, oh, it's an uh. E with a snake on it. There's a couple of adorable snake clay figurines. I'll have to open these too. Thank you so much, Jasmine, for all of these gifts. I love them. So Eliza sent us a note, a couple dollars for Cheyenne what? for nuts. Aw. She also has a couple questions. What's your favorite Wings of Fire character? Probably Glory, the, the rain wing. Hers are Glory and Deathbringer. Oh, hey! There you go. What's your favorite type of snake on Earth? Oh, I really like dragon snakes. I think they look really cool. Yeah, those are cool. Can't wait till they're more established in captivity. Mm -hmm. She also sent some drawings. Aww. And <gasps> a big bag of Lindor chocolates. Oh my gosh! And she's already eating them. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so good. Thank you so much. Thank you, Eliza. Aw, JC and Parker sent some very sweet notes, and along with it, they sent one of the greatest treats of all time that isn't chocolate, sour night crawlers, sour Ooh. gummy worms. I know Ed really likes these. Like I sour? like gummy candies. Oh, you just like gummy candies? Mm -hmm. Thank you, JC and Parker. So here we got a note from Greta, really nice note, and a shell from her hermit crab molted. <laughs> oh, cool. Hermit crab shell. Cool. But she also made us this. 
Whoa. She said she likes Pokemon and Snake Discovery, oh. so she combined the two. How have we never thought of that before? I don't know. Yes, we need to do this now. Thank you. Sarah, Valeria, Kindle, and Elijah each sent us a dollar. Guys, you don't have to send us cash. You are too nice. Save this, save this like for a pet snake of your own Sunday. But I promise we will use it for our animals. And I think for this video, we're going to use the Elsa lunchbox for Rex fish funds or just general reptile fish funds. So thank you. Turner sent us a bag full of Pokemon cards. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to go through these. And oh my gosh, this is like the gummy snake episode because he also sent gummy snakes. Oh, those are better. What? Yeah, those are better. No, I like... Those are totally better. I'll take those. I mean, You're these good. are delicious. You're Don't get me have wrong. All of those. I'll take this. I want them both, though. No, these are these are amazing. Oh, Ed claims those. Yep. All right. Well, I'm just gonna keep snacking on all of these because this one's. I like the sour ones. They're both delicious. Thank you, guys. So I made Cheyenne poop and brought her down because Michaela made her a bandana, but it's a oh. reptile-themed bandana. That's cool. She's going to take off her sock bib, and then swap it out for. Lizard bandana. There. Yeah. I don't think she can untie it. No, she might not be able to. Thanks, Michaela. And then there's also a package here for Cheyenne, according to Ed, from Abigail. Aww. Abigail. Big old bag of banana chips. Aww. Yes. I can already tell she's not going to eat it now. Well, oh, the banana chip? <laughs> That's true. I would give her one, but since she's upset about having a new thing around her neck, she might not eat this right now. So I might feed her one of these later. Aww, she also sent a... Dollar, can you do a playing video with Cheyenne, Abigail asks. Yeah, like playing with her with different toys. That would be cute. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Thanks, Abigail, for all the gifts. I also have a gift over here from Paloma, who sent us a nice note and a dollar. Aww. And some other things. But she also sent, it's a green tree python that sticks on the stick. Oh. And that's attached to the stick. That's a cool idea. And uh, she also sent you one, and you have to guess what it is. I don't think they're normally known for wrapping like this, and we have one. Oh, I know what that is. Who is that? This must be a Brazilian rainbow boa. Yes, it is. Nice job. I could totally tell. Nice job on these. Thank you so much. Thank you, Paloma. Jacob, I love your drawing of Rex. And great job using the tutorial to make necklaces out of your snake shed. That's awesome. Also, thank you for the couple dollars in, like, quarters. This will go into the frozen themed rex's fish fun box guys you are too nice so i have a box over here from kaya from florida oh what is that oh it's a snake discovery clock snake discovery clock nice thanks kaya did you make that that looks amazing yes it does while ed sets up the clock i'm just gonna play with this sweet fidget spinner that came in the mail thank you so much for this Oh my gosh, it works. Oh, thank you, Kaya, for the clock. Okay, get ready for this, guys. Tevin from Washington sent us shrinky dinks of our animals. There's Cheyenne, nearly headless Nick, another nearly headless Nick, and Rex. Rex at the pet store. Thank you, Tevin. This is awesome. Also, thank you for the dollar for the animals and for <gasps> the chocolate. So, Xander from Australia. Sent us a picture of candy cane. Aww. Their dream snake is an albino Siloan milk snake. Oh, Siloan, that's a great. Siloan, yes, yeah, Siloan. Uh, they also sent a gift pack of stuff from Australia. <gasps> no so, way. Like. Oh, Xander, you shouldn't have. Looks like popcorn chocolate. Harbor fireworks. Might as well open that up now I, and try it. I think we should. Yeah. Australian fireworks chocolate. Mm -hmm. Very good. They also sent gummy snakes. No, oh, not it's the gummy episode. It is. It's Whoa. Just gummy. We have to try that now. Then he also sent us something I'm surprised we haven't gotten yet that we have to try. Oh, no. Oh, no. No! I was hoping we, I wouldn't have to try this. So, I will go prepare toast. Oh, no. With Vegemite. I've heard things. And I'll be back. Well, Ed is preparing Vegemite toast, apparently. I'll open this package from Xavier and Penelope. Oh my gosh, I love all the drawings. Aw, oh, okay, so Xavier has sent two decks of Pokemon cards? Oh my gosh, Xavier! 
That is, is that like almost all holographic or reverse holographic? That is so nice of you. There's also adorable plush turtles and like, aw, handmade turtles. And there's chocolate in here. Oh, oh cute. Pokemon figurines. Is that Reshiram? That's gotta be. Whoa. Oh my gosh, what's in here? Aw, that's a beautiful neck. Oh, cool. It's a shark tooth necklace. Xavier and Penelope, thank you so much for all of these gifts. I can't wait to dive into that chocolate bar. And oh, and there's even a book in here. I'll have to open that too. Thank you so much. There's also very something very nice in the letter. Five Canadian dollars. Thank you so much, guys. This was very nice of you. You didn't have to send all of this, but thank you. I have it. Oh no. So I did what you're supposed to do, which is a thin layer, but I figured that wouldn't be enough. Oh. So I put a big glob on one end. Oh, thanks. That we both have to try. Here, eat yours first. Have you ever had Vegemite before? Mm -mm. Good. It's, it's not bad. I can see how it get, would get overpowering, especially with the big glob. Yeah, probably. <sighs> I'm gonna like it. I'm gonna like it. It's gonna be tasty. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I need a garbage. I ate it. All right, now take the big glob. No. Do it. No. Do it for the subscribers. As long as you're expecting salty savory, it's not bad. Oh. <laughs> it's all over my mouth. And I that, can't do it. And that's how we break <laughs> Emily. <laughs> Goodbye. I usually love everything people send, but Vegemite, I can't do it. I'm sorry. Well, thank you, Xander, for all the goodies. I think Austin sent us a mop. This a is, mop? Yeah, this is from Austin in Washington. Oh, it's not a mop. Aww. Oh, it's like a magic trick. Whoa. It says, my name is Bronze. Thank you, uh, Austin, for the ball python. That's a big ball python. Yeah, this is pretty accurate, though. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Here, I'll put it around me and Cheyenne. Aw, best friends forever. Aww. So, Valerie sent us some cool artwork. She also sent me this sweet turtle ring. She also sent... Oh my gosh. Hershey's. A lot of a Hershey's. A lot of Hershey's. Ah! I'll just go and start off a couple of these. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Valerie. I have from Abby a cute painting of a hognose snake. Isn't that adorable? It is. Aww. Thank you, Abby. Thank you, Abby. That is the cutest little container I've seen in a while. Perfect. Blades Now. Blades is that a knife? Now. I think it might be bladesnow.com. So I'm I can open this one. No, no, I'll keep <laughs> this over here. It looks like this is from Jay from Blades Now, who likes the videos we do and sees that we do fan mail. So he sent us a knife to huh. use for fan mail. Maybe I could have one of them and you could have the other. No, it's Whoa. like oh. scaly. Oh, cool. And it also said, I think it's spring assisted. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yes, it's spring assisted. Yeah, that one's too, too fancy. Yeah, I'm and... not going to let you have this one. I think that's for breaking windows if you're in a car oh, and you're, like, you're falling in the water, you use that to smash a window so you can get out. This is like a legit knife. Yeah, that's a cool knife. Whoa. <laughs> that was the worst decision I ever made, <laughs> yeah, I'm I think. I'm surprised you handed it to me. That was really nice of them. Yeah. I really like the pattern that's used on this. So if anybody's interested in knives like these, or this one in particular, I guess he did send us a code that was for anything on this site, for bladesnow.com. So Charles, if you don't mind putting bladesnow.com here, and then it's snake five here, you can get this and get 5% off of your entire purchase. Thank you, Blades Now. Thank you, Jay. Illustrated by Megan, the story of pancake. Aw, I'm gonna just flip through this. And she also sent this alligator puppet but I can't turn pages with it. It's gonna kind of go like this and this and it's a really cute comic. So this way you can pause and read and then keep going. And that, thank you, Megan. What do you have, Ed? So Emerson, a fan of the channel, got a ribbon snake recently. Oh, cool, a ribbon snake. I had to cover up her face because of YouTube and all that kind of stuff. But she also sent, <gasps> oh, double the chocolates! Double, double chocolates. Oh, does it say they're both for Emily? Uh, 
I think it does. I mean, it says, Dear Emily. It doesn't say Sweet. anything about me. They're both for me. Thank you, Emerson. So, Daniel sent us some sweet Pokemon cards here. And some Ellie's Bittersweet Chocolate. Whoa. That's good chocolate. I like it. It's not super super bitter. Mm. That's delicious. That is pretty good. Thank you, Daniel. This is going to last me all of, like, maybe three minutes. Noelle sent this. Oh, oh, is that a chocolate bar? That's gotta be. Dark chocolate with caramel and sea salt. Oh my gosh, it has all of the delicious things in one bar. And there's more in here from Noelle too. Whoa, mint and dark chocolate Kit Kat. Do you wanna try another weird Kit Kat? It's like an Andy's mint mixed with a Kit Kat. Mm -hmm. And then that other one was like an orange chocolate thing mixed with a Kit Kat. For Emily, what garter snake is your favorite that you own? And Ed, what green tree python is your favorite? Dolores or Cruella. Oh, you're two big favorite. girls? Yeah, my two big girls. My yeah. favorite garter is probably... There she is! Twiggy! Hi, Twiggy! You're my favorite, don't tell the others! Okay, goodbye. Noah from UK sent us a box of stuff. Ooh. And he said one of the funniest things I've ever heard in a note. He <laughs> says, I really want to go to the Amazon and Wisconsin to see you guys. Oh, nice. <laughs> I've never heard those two things in the same sentence. I either want to go to the Amazon jungle or Wisconsin. <laughs> Wisconsin's a pretty hot tourist attraction. You know it. We've got all the cheese. Also, he wants to know how the Amazon milk frogs are doing. Oh, they're really good. They're not calling at night like they used to be, so it's out of their breeding season, I think, but they're doing really well. He also wants to know if we're ever planning on getting a tortoise. Yeah, probably a tortoise, maybe yep. for a facility. I think maybe. we're probably going to do some kind of a rescue tortoise at the facility, mm -hmm. so people can have a big cicada to run around with. He also sent some cool reptile stuff, Aww. so a little coconut hide, and I'm guessing a frog water dish? Probably! Those are really cute. Really cool. Thank you! And cream chocolate. Whoa! <laughs> One's upside Wait. down. There you Wait. go. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, cream center. Oh, it's like minty. Ooh, yeah it is. I wasn't expecting that. That's pretty good. Mm-hmm. Whoa, thank you. Cool, thank you, Noah. Before we wrap up with our last two epic packages, check out all of these pet pictures that people sent. Look at all of your adorable animals, whether skilled or furry or feathered. Thanks for sending these pictures. Also, it's time to thank everyone who sent us Pokemon cards. Lily sent all sorts. There's Brakeson in there. I think that's how you pronounce that one. I'm not sure. Oh, and a Weezing. Elias sent a very nice card with some artwork and some cards like Pokemon cards. Oh, look at the snubble. Regan sent... Oh, cute. A reverse holographic whooper. I love it. I don't see a name on this note, but you probably know who you are because you put a card. First off, you sent a couple dollars for Rex. Thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. And there's a single card upside down for Ed. Oh, that's cute. Any guesses? Badoof. Not Badoof. I like uh, how that was your first guess, though. What generation? First generation. Charmander. The most popular Pokemon. Pikachu. Yeah, Pikachu. It's a nice, a really cute Aww. Pikachu. It matches your shirt. Got a whole fire theme of Pokemon cards from Ariel. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Look at these crazy cards. Oh my gosh, it's Latios EX card. Whoa, Luke, thank you so much. This was really nice of you. Oh my gosh. Miranda sent a bunch of cards too. I'm not sure what got on your note there in transit, but these cards are adorable. Look at the Psyduck. Elio sent all sorts here, like bipedal Pokemon theme. I love it. I also can't find a name on your note, but thank you for these cards. I love the star you and star me. Also, Catriel, if hopefully I'm pronouncing your name right, sent some cool original Pokemon. Look at those. Phoenix sent some cute cards. Ooh, there is Mewtwo and Mew in that holographic Mew. Thank you, Phoenix. Also, thank you for the $5. You're too nice. Scar sent like a whole deck's worth of fire themed Pokemon, including holographic Moltres. That is epic. And finally, we got a bunch from Will. Oh, is that an Umbreon? That is an Umbreon, my favorite Pokemon. Oh my gosh. And there's like Ekans and Rayquaza. Oh my gosh. Whoa. These are so nice of you. Look, there's another Umbreon. Thank you guys, thank you so much for all these cards. You don't have to send us such nice cards. You are super generous. Look what I learned you can do with Pokemon cards. Whoa. Oh. Oh. There we go. That was uh, pretty cool. I'd also like to thank Leon and Zany and Ruby and Barbara and Lexi and Noah and Abigail and Angelina and Emily and Aliyah, Hasley, 
Blythe, B, Hudson, Van, Natalie, Mackenzie, William, Rory, and Jesse whew, for sending a dollar or two to us in an envelope with your art. I will try to include the art either at this at the end of this video or the next one, but thank you so much, everybody. You are so generous. You guys don't have to send us cash. It's okay. I put it in the Rex's Fish Fun 2.0 container here because the other one got full from all of your generosity. We'll have to bring both of these to the pet store then and buy some goodies at two million. Are you just throwing Pokemon cards everywhere? No. Last two packages. Are you excited? She's wearing her bandana really well, actually. Mm -hmm. I might leave it on her. This one's from Emma in Texas. Cheyenne. Oh, it's Cheyenne. It's you. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Beware of the Western hog nose. That's such a cute, like, poster board. It's like a, a metal sign. Yeah, there what? we go. Sign, that's the word I'm looking for. Emma. Oh my gosh, you sent us Pokemon cards. And a bunch of Pokemon and cards. And a metal sign. Where are we going to hang this? I have to hang it up wherever we have the Western Hognose is at. That's true. That is a really cute sign. Thank you so much, Emma. For the last package, we have a note from the Crazy Asian. Or they made um, friendship bracelets Aww. for us. That's really cute. Ooh, I like both of those. Those are cool designs. This is a snake. That's really cute. There's also, I see Pikachu on this. I don't know what it is exactly. Oh, no way. Oh, it's a pillowcase. It's a Pikachu pillowcase. Nice. Thank you, crazy Asian. Or a I snake I feel bag. bad saying that, but that's what they signed their name as, is I mean, the crazy Asian. what they call themselves. And there's more in here, too. There's... Wow. Oh, my gosh. Holy moly. Holy cow. There's, like, one of every flavor. There is mint cookie crunch. Dark chocolate with raspberry, sea salt, caramel, milk chocolate with peanut butter, uh, milk chocolate with brownie batter, oh, and another brownie batter. Uh, raspberry. Raspberry? That's what I was thinking, too, actually. Oh, it's a raspberry filling. Oh. That's cool. Thank you, Crazy Asian. That was very, very good. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much, everybody, for your generous gifts and thoughtful gifts. And I, I'm at a loss of words every time. And I know yeah. that I say this a lot, but... We're always just shocked by the amount of support that we get for the channel, and it's incredible what you've said. So thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. As always, we'd like to thank our amazing Patreon supporters for also backing this channel. You are also so generous, all of you. And thank you to everyone who's just here watching our videos. For those of you who sent a message or some artwork and... I, I'm sorry we're not able to include every single note that comes through, but we do read them all and we love them all and we'll include some art at the end of this video. Charles always does a great job putting a slideshow together, so we'll put some art we just got at the end of the video and we'll see you next time.